हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड टाइम टू ऑल आई एम चंदन कुमार प्रधान वेलकम टू यूट्यूब चैनल चंदन फिजिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस मैग्नेटिक वेक्टर पोटेंशियल लेट्स एगेन वी नो फ्रॉम द प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ मैग्नेटिक फील्ड द डाइवर्जेंस एंड कॉल ऑफ मैग्नेटिक फील्ड डाइवर्जेंस ऑफ मैग्नेटिक फील्ड ग्रेटेड बी इज इक्वल टू जीरो बेसिक प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ डाइवर्जेंस और देयर विल बी एन आइडेंटिटी दैट इज द वेक्टर आइडेंटिटी आल्सो बाय डेफिनेशन we know the divergence of call of a vector divergence of call of a vector let that vector is a vector is zero divergence of call of vector that is डाइवर्जेंस कॉल ऑफ ए वेक्टर इज इक्वल टू जीरो और दैट इज ग्राड डॉट ग्राड क्रॉस ए इज इक्वल टू जीरो दिस इज वन ऑफ द वेक्टर आइडेंटिटी ना कंपेयरिंग इक्वेशन वन एंड टू comparing equation 1 and 2 we get graded b is equal to grad dot grad cross a grad dot b grad dot ग्रेड क्रॉस ए ग्रेडिएंट ऑफ ए वेक्टर ग्रेडिएंट ऑफ ए वेक्टर दर फोर बी वेक्टर इज इक्वल टू ग्रेड क्रॉस ए द मैग्नेटिक फील्ड इज द कॉल ऑफ वेक्टर हियर दैट ए वेक्टर इज कॉल्ड द मैग्नेटिक वेक्टर पोटेंशियल is called magnetic vector potential now we define that magnetic vector potential a vector is defined as that is the call of the vector so magnetic flux is the call of magnetic vector potential thus we say magnetic vector potential a vector is defined as defined in such way that its call gives the magnetic flux density its flux
gives magnetic flux density magnetic vector potential a vector is defined as the such a that its flux gives the magnetic flux density its call sorry its call its call gives magnetic flux density another property of magnetic field that the call of magnetic field also we know that two pro two basic property of magnetic field that is divergence of magnetic field and call of magnetic field that we have from divergence of magnetic field then from from call of magnetic field grad cross b is equal to mu not j equation number 4 in place of b vector we substitute grad cross a using equation 3 in equation 4 equation 4 we get grad cross in place of b grad cross a grad cross a is equal to mu naught j again from the identity from vector identity we have grad cross grad cross a is equal to grad of grad dot a minus grad square a here the grad square which is known as the laplacian operator that is grad dot grad that is the laplacian operator and it is defined as grad square del square del x square del square del y square del square del z square now using that vector identity grad of grad dot a minus grad square a is equal to mu naught j or it is grad dot a grad dot a is 0 grad dot a is equal to 0 why because we choose we have to choose a vector such uh, a way that that vector is a solenoidal one that the vector a should be solenoidal solenoidal vector 
then to the property of solenoidal vector gradient of that vector will be 0 that term is 0 minus grad square a is equal to mu naught j or grad square a is equal to minus mu naught j equation number 5. This equation this equation is known as Poisson's equation Poisson's equation for magnetic vector potential magnetic vector potential this equation is known as Poisson's equation for magnetic vector potential. If uh, we write that vector in terms of rectangular components, in terms of rectangular components, grad square let that a vector is written as a x i cap a y j cap plus a z k cap is equal to minus mu naught j vector as j x i cap j y j cap j z k cap comparing these both sides of that equation we have grad square a x is equal to minus mu naught j x grad square a y is equal to minus mu naught j y grad square a z is equal to minus mu naught j z equation number 6 equation number 7 and equation number 8. Again, we studied about Laplace's equation and Poisson's equation in case of electrostatics. From this one, in electrostatics, The Poisson's equation, the Poisson's equation for electrostatic potential, potential is given by grad square v is equal to minus rho divided by epsilon naught where rho is the volume charge density epsilon naught permittivity of free space where that potential v is given as for a point charge 1 by or we can say that is q by 4 pi epsilon naught dou r that point charge the point of observation is at a distance of r from that point charge this is the potential that be the potential so in place of charge as charge to total charge 
for a volumetric charge distribution we have volume integration of rho dv rho is the volume charge density therefore potential v is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught volumetric integration volume integration rho dv replace a charge q divided by r look at that potential term this equation grad square a is equal to negative of minus that is minus mu naught j vector this equation in the Poisson's equation this is the Poisson's equation for magnetic vector potential here same way that one with the Poisson's equation in electrostatic potential now comparing these two equations we have here a with the magnetic vector potential here b with the potential mu naught permeability of free space if epsilon naught permittivity of free space j vector current density rho that is volume charge density now comparing this result as the potential v is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught volume integration rho dv by r by taking that one the solution of these terms grad square a x minus v naught j x are written as grad square a x is equal to minus mu naught j x therefore the value of a x right that way in electrostatics epsilon naught as analogous with mu naught in magnetostatics and these two are reciprocal if epsilon naught in the denominator here mu naught is in the numerator part so that potential term is just like this the constant term that is 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught here we, we introduce mu naught divided by 4 pi an integration over that volume here rho plays the same role as current density j x dv divided by r similarly grad square a y minus mu naught j y or a y mu naught by 4 phi volume integration j y dv by r and grad square a z minus mu naught j z or a z is equal to mu naught by 4 pi volume integration j z dv by r in generalizing these terms on generalizing in general a vector is written as mu naught by 4 phi volume integration j dv divided by r that is the required expression 
for magnetic vector potential. By using that magnetic vector potential, so many things are calculated. As as uh, we say magnetic flux density sorry magnetic flux phi b surface integration of b dot ds as b vector is gra cross a vector s gra cross a ds again using stokes theorem surface integral sense to line integral phi b that change to line integral a dot dl as a vector d phi by dl the vector potential and the unit of a vector flux over per length meter in si by using vector potential magnetic vector potential we just introduce magnetic flux so here with the help of this visual exercise we understand magnetic vector potential to derive magnetic vector potential we introduce the properties of magnetic field that is gradient of magnetic field which results zero from this we have b vector is equal to grad cross a and a vector which is known as magnetic vector potential again another property of magnetic field that is call of that magnetic field is mu no times of the current density from this we have grad square a is equal to mu not j vector which is known as poisson's equations for magnetic vector potential we compare that poisson's equation in magnetic vector potential with the poisson's equation in case of electrostatics on comparing these two defined terms we have the vector potential terms and generalizing the vector potential terms we have that vector potential a vector is equal to mu not 4 pi volume integration of j dv divided by r this one this is the expression for magnetic vector potential the expression for magnetic vector potential by using the property of magnetic vector potential we can easily define magnetic flux and its unit so with this useful and introductory notes let me wind up this session thank you